Hello, brothers and sisters of the light, fellow star seeds, way showers, light bringers, the change makers, the grid workers, and the awakened collective, which is all of you. I am Julie Joy, your servant of the light, with another message for you from the Ninth Dimensional Arcturian Council. It's channeled by Daniel Scranton for July 17th, 2023. And the title of this message is Awakening the Sleeping Ones. And they begin, greetings, we are the Arcturian Council. We are pleased to connect with all of you. We are working so closely with your sun to bring about a different type of energy and light transmission that will be detectable by those of you who are awake and paying attention to what you can feel. You can already feel so much coming from your sun, your earth, your oceans, and all of Mother Nature. You can feel so much coming from the stars, from starlight, and even from moonlight if you are tuned in and and if you are paying attention. What we are working on with your sun will affect all, regardless of how sensitive they are and regardless of whether they are paying attention to the different ways that the energies and light hit you from various celestial bodies. The first and most important thing to do in order to benefit most from all of this will be for you to ground into your physical body. Next, you want to make sure you are feeling grounded into Mother Earth. And thirdly, you want to open up to the energies coming in from those very real, very detectable, very physical beings and bodies. The light that you receive is an aspect of physical reality that truly is spiritual. Everything can be spiritual if you take that attitude to it. But something that is fundamentally spiritual in nature, something that represents Source and the love of Source so well, can be given extra attention by those of you who are awake. And it can also affect those who are still asleep. We, along with your son, are hoping to awaken more who are asleep with light, which is the best thing to be awakened by. People need to, of course, allow themselves to be hit by that light, and it is better if they allow the light in directly rather than through a window, but even light that hits you through a window still has some effect on you. We want you to feel for the differences that you can detect at the point when you are aware of the sunlight hitting you and at the point when you are aware of starlight and moonlight hitting you. Awaken to the truth that you are always being helped and that the help is all around you. You don't have to go looking for it and you don't have to ask for it. The help is more impactful when you consciously and deliberately let it in, however. And so that is what we are encouraging you to do at this time, knowing that many of you are already doing it, but some of you simply need the reminder from time to time of how much powerful energy there is coming in from everywhere. This is a time to be basking and receiving what is always there for you, always seeking to help. And the help is just getting amplified at this time. We are the Arcturian Council, and we have enjoyed connecting with you. So at this particular time, I recorded this on July 18th. There are CMEs coming in from the sun. There's all kinds of solar flares. Even the mainstream news is full of this information, and I can certainly feel it. This marvelous message was channeled by Daniel Scranton. His own website is danielscranton.com. His YouTube channel is simply his name, Daniel Scranton. I will be able to post the words to this message below in the show more section. I am Julie Joy, your servant of the light. Always so proud and grateful to be able to bring these messages to all of you.